Hey, it's Curio Cabinet Jasper Noseworthy. Jasper, Curio Cabinet Noseworthy. Let's get into the sports. The sports. Brought to you by Match.com. The Brewers had a four-game series with the Seattle Mariners over the weekend. Bring out your wives. It's looking like a sweep. There are so many players under the dreaded Mendoza line, I'm surprised these games even aired. Now, game one of this series heralded, heralded Kevin Jarvis as a new reliever. Get off the ship while you have the chance, buddy. Milwaukee's new golden boy, Scott Carroll, had a rough first inning, but John Jaha pulled, out, pulled him out of the weeds with a grand slam in the third. It's a boy. For the Mariners, game two was even worse. Their ace, Randy Johnson, couldn't even escape the second inning where our Brewers scored three of our 14 runs. The hits kept coming in the next game where we scored five on 14. If you're keeping track like I was, that was 21 runs over 40 hits. Start selling your Mariners. Pogs. The Mariners' new GM, Chris Clemmer, might have gotten all his money from his wife, but he obviously... Didn't get her baseball know-how. By the final game of the series, I guess our guys were tired because they only put up eight. I don't know how Dan Wilson was named AL Player of the Week last week given this week's performance, but your AL Player of the Week should be this week. John Jaha for starting off our weekend right. On to the next one. 